Yo, what is up everybody, and welcome back to another Madden 18 Ultimate Team Game. You guys see the squad including our 7 Golden Ticket players, as we will be getting ball first to start this game off. Barry Sanders on the return, spinning to about the 28-yard line. This is a week and week qualifier game, where you have to win 3 games in a row in order to qualify for weekend league as we run Juju Smith-Schuster for a couple of yards on the end of the round. Looking to pass with Vic, but we actually leave the pocket instead. And Vic on the spin move. Oh, try to hit him on a double spin right there. Still got a first down as we run the ball with McCaffrey in trouble. Oh, McCaffrey able to turn it up field and actually gets a gain of two yards on that one as we run it again with Christian. And this time... Nearly gets us a first down, trying to spin, spin until we win. Oh, but third down, we get sacked immediately. Bring up fourth down, we keep the offense on the field. Play action, Michael Vick protected well, leaving the pocket downfield for Juju. But it's intercepted by Eric Weddle. A sloppy start to the game. I felt like we were in good position with the third down too, but we got sacked so quickly and that just kind of derailed everything else. And I think that was a bad playmaker on my behalf on that fourth down play. But now we focus on defense shutting down the run game third down it's play action he's got Michael Vick but Michael Vick's going nowhere on that one fourth down he's also going for it he's also looking to pass with big middle got his man for the first threading the needle to Shannon Sharp next play down the middle it's Sharp again he's gonna run hurry up right here try to potentially get a touchdown before the end of the first quarter one more time passing and he gets another completion but this time it's to the wrong team. Luke Keekley interception and nearly took it all the way. Calvin Johnson saves a potential pick six as he sends a blitz. We're going for it all to Randy Moss. Oh man, we could just rack out that one like I wanted to. We would have been fine for at least a first down. Instead, here we are third down and 13 as he once again tries to send the pressure, leaving the pocket and barely able to avoid a sack. And now fourth down. We're in a pretty bad position right here as we go downfield. This time, Randy Moss has got it. Ronald Darby stands no chance to keep up with Moss. Touchdown. If you're here for the title, you're probably like, what? How did... How you didn't even score in the first quarter. How in the world are we going to get to triple digit figure points for our team? Well, that fumble on the kickoff just helped out a lot. Second down and 16. This play should help as well because Michael Vick is dancing, leaving the pocket, rolling out, using his legs, spinning, and nearly, nearly creating a top 10 play. Instead, we will have to settle for a touchdown on the very next play to Juju Smith. Schuster, nice tight catching coverage. Nice user pick by Eric Berry. We're going berry picking, and he just made the mistake of putting his hands in the cookie jar. We're going for Moss again. And Randy Moss and Ronald Darby, not a match made in heaven, all right? Because, I mean, I don't know how much faster Randy Moss is than Ronald Darby in this game, but, I mean, it's Randy Moss, so he's faster. And that's a bad play intercepted by Kyle Fuller. Trying to make something special happen up 21 zip now very quickly. This game was tied 0-0 at the end of the first quarter. And now here we are with Christian McCaffrey in for the touchdown on the pitch. And this guy has fallen apart. You can feel him demoralized a little bit at this point. You saw at the end of that touchdown run, he kind of pulled one of his defenders back. And normally when people do that in a game, that's when they start getting demoralized. That's when they're kind of, you know, just out of it. They're just like almost delusional that they're getting killed so badly in the game that they start doing the unthinkable and actually intentionally losing by more. Check out this Randy Moss pick six. He is pulling Bo Jackson or Herschel Walker backward to make sure Herschel Walker doesn't make the tackle. I don't know. This is not the first time I've had this happen in the game. And I don't know why people do this when they are down a lot. They start pulling their guys back and like, hey, why don't you score another one? But listen, if someone's going to do that for me, and someone keeps putting their hands in the cookie jar like this guy's going to do. <laughs> Letting us get user picks all day with Eric Berry. I'm going to score, man. If you're not going to quit, and you're going to... I mean, hey, I, might as well, right? I, I got nothing else to do for the next 20 minutes while I'm in this Madden game with this guy. If he's not going to quit as he gets sacked. Loss of 9 yards. Michael Vick feeling the pressure near his own end zone. Expected well, but he's got nothing open. Just a lob. 
And that's Golden Ticket Cal Fuller. So we're not going to allow that to happen. Third down and 19. Minute left in the first half. Vick is spilled at his own two-yard line. Fourth down and 26. Why not go for it? Just got to let it loose. And it's intercepted by Kyle Fuller. Not a good interception right there because we just swat that one away. Easily just get the ball to two-yard line, maybe score in the next play. Instead, here we are, first down at the 41-yard line, actually hitting T.Y. Hilton for the first down. Smart play would have been to get inbounds, but we're not really going for smart plays at this point. I'm just trying to have some fun, make some highlight plays, hit some spins and jukes on this poor fella as we hit Christian McCaffrey wide open out the backfield and get the touchdown. Yeah, I did call timeouts during that drive. Hey, look, man, if I'm going to be in the game. I might as well... Try to score a touchdown while I'm here, right? As much as I'd love to get out of this game, I see a chance to put up a lot of points on the board, and I'm not going to pass that up as he's going to call a timeout with four seconds left. He wants to go for a Hail Mary. So why not? Let's see what he's got. And it's in inter Eric Berry with the hat trick in the first half. In one half. Yeah, we have definitely gone berry picking today, and our basket is full. We are. We have an excess of berries in our basket as Herschel Walker on the run play. I guess you got to run the ball to start the second half just to ease things in and then get sacked in the very next play. And then, you know, all of a sudden it's like, yeah, I, I don't know what this guy plans on doing as he tries to playmake or someone. He tries to make a play with Big. He gets tackled by Clowney for a down. Can he make a positive play? No, absolutely not. Ray Lewis with the sack and just stuffing Michael Vick. And remember, this guy had a good first quarter. He stopped us on four downs. He made it to the red zone. As we get the touchdown to Randy Moss right there. But then he threw the interception to Luke Keekly. Let's say he gets a touchdown on that first drive. This could be a totally different game. He could be in it to win it. It could be a tie game. He could be up by 21. Who knows? But that one mistake has definitely defined this game. And it's been downhill ever since Leonard Floyd. Another one of those golden tickets on our team. With the user pick. With the pick six. He's put his hands in the cookie jar like... You know, a billion times. He has not learned his lesson yet. But at the same time, that was a pretty nasty work right there. Couldn't really expect him to see us coming on that play as he lobs it. Barry hasn't got it, but Sean Taylor does. Sean Taylor wants to join the party, and this guy wants us to party in the end zone. He's pulling his players once again, and we're actually going to trip over Herschel Walker. He was trying to get out the way, but I, I probably would have been better off going to the left right there, but he was so generous that we actually tripped over him and still went for a touchdown. So when you see a game like this and the guy intentionally giving up touchdowns the obvious thought is this game is rigged right like there's no way to like this is a fixed game this is a fixed game this guy's just letting you score as many points as possible i don't know who this guy is i don't know who Doc, i just know it's his nickname or um, his username doc vader I, I like that but i don't know who doc vader is all right i don't know who he is i don't know what he's about i don't know if he knows who i am i don't know what his mo was during our 30 plus minutes of playing madden but um, at some point, like, he, the weird thing is, like, he pulls back and gives me touchdowns whenever I get an interception or something like that, but look at this, he's, he's playing some clamp defense right now, I'm trying to put up points, and he's coming out with some nice little two-man under, he's using well with his, uh, his Ryan Shays here in the middle, it's fourth down and one, he, he's in it to get a stop, but, unfortunately, Doc Vader is lacking a little bit of Madden skills, so that's where the, uh, difference is in, you know, most of the game. But, like I said, he's he's putting up a fight this drive, man. He's not been... I mean, he is coming out on, like, some heavy coverage defense that we can run the ball on. But I'm trying to pass the ball, and he's clamping up the passing game right now. Though, so, you know, eventually we are going to find some cracks if he runs man coverage every single play. So, we hit Juju. And same play. Why not? But... He's come up with the user pick, man. He's, he's, he's trying to put up some points. I don't know what exactly he's in here to do, but... He's not just bending over backward. He is trying to put together. He's feeling himself now. It's not, he's throwing 10 interceptions. He's throwing 10 I got, Hold on. Make that 11. Make that 11. And you know what? That didn't deserve to be an interception. If you watch that back, I don't know how in the world Kyle Fuller managed to pick that ball off. And Tip Drill managed to light up when the ball wasn't in his hands. I have no idea what in the world happened on that pick six. But poor guy. That was the most confidence he's had all day long. We just took it away from him, and he probably just threw something against the wall at this point. But he's still in the game. He's still in the game. And here's where he really gives up. In the fourth quarter, it is 77 points. I am... I'm going to keep it real with you guys. Keep it 100. I've been trying to score 100 points since, like, the end of, like, the second... Like, end of the first half. I've been trying to put up 100 points on this guy, at least. As many points as possible. 
and we were not really on target to get it, especially after we threw the interception near the end of the third quarter as we throw another one to William Jackson. But this is helping. This is definitely helping. Him just running back. He, I mean, he's feeling the pressure from the sides, but instead of getting rid of it, he's just taking sacks and getting called for and like pretty much intentional safety. So, yeah, I don't know what he's doing, but look at this. He's like user in Juju's route. I want to throw it to Juju. He's got his man burned, but he's all over with Shay's ear. He... he I, I don't know exactly how badly he wants us to put up 200 points, but it's not bad enough where he's letting us go. But it is bad enough where, you know, he's running some weird stuff. Third down, he gets a stop right here. Fourth down, we're actually going to punt the ball. Nah, just kidding. We're throwing it with Bo in the middle to Brian Dawkins. And Weapon X is in. And once again, he kind of pulled his guys from the side. But I don't even know if you matter in that play. Weapon X was kind of gone as he is called for the safety again. We are 10 points away from 100 with two minutes left. It's going to be close. I think we can do it. And look at you, Davion. Clowney on the spin move. Clowney is in the first and easily only return touchdown. Jadavion Clowney will get in any form of football. Pee wee. Maybe in Pee wee he can get it. But like, college not getting that. NFL not getting that. Madden, you won't see anybody return anything with Jadavion Clowney. You saw I went for two right there, and I didn't get it. The reason why I went for two is because I figured if he got called for another safety, that would be me scoring 100 points, and then I would be satisfied for the rest of the game. But now we have to score at least a field goal, if not a touchdown. At this point, I would take a field goal if the opportunity presented to itself. But he is literally giving me the touchdown right now. He moves Darby out the way. And Madden doesn't even want me to do this. Wide open guy. How did I not hit him? Check this out. I'm holding down rat catch. Really, Madden? Aggressive catch? Thankfully, this guy was nice enough to just move his guys out the way. And we scored a touchdown nonetheless. But Madden really didn't want us to score 100 points. And we had a wide open Randy Moss and somehow had an offensive lineman. Thankfully, 104. We cracked the triple digits. Always cool to do that. And right after the guy quits. Which I, I don't understand. Like I said, I don't know who this guy is. I don't know what he was thinking. But I'm okay with it. I got my 100. He quit. I think we are both satisfied at the end of the day. I, actually, he's not satisfied at all. He just lost by 100 points in Madden. But as you see, this is an online game. I didn't edit any of this stuff out. You guys see it was a weekly league qualifier game. So I don't know what his deal was. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys leave a like in the video if you guys enjoyed us putting up 100 points. I'm not going to claim it was like a really impressive feat. Because like at some point, this guy just started taking the absolute piss. But... It, it was fun for me, at least. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed watching it. So if you did, leave a like in the video. Subscribe for more Madden 18, eventually Madden 19 gameplays. And I will catch you guys next time.